We've published APIs in the developer portal. Now let's look at monitoring and analytics. Apigee Edge includes a number of built-in analytics charts. The most basic is the traffic volume chart. Here you can see traffic volumes over time, over the week, the day, the hour. You can also select custom time periods. All of this is powered by Google Cloud Analytics, so you get great performance from these charts even with huge API traffic volumes. That's traffic volume, but thinking outside in, we'd like to understand the experience users are getting from the APIs. What's the response time? Here we can see the median response time, as well as the 95th percentile and the 99th percentile. Analyzing these trends can help you identify when your backend services start to show strain under load. In fact, Apigee Edge Analytics can be a major benefit of Apigee Edge, even if you don't perform transforms or apply security in your proxy. This response time insight can be invaluable as you perform A-B tests or roll out new services. Now let's look at error reporting. In any high volume system, there will be errors. Some are good errors, like a 401 when an expired token is presented. Some are unexpected. With the error code analysis chart, you can examine error code trends and better understand where the errors are occurring and why. This chart can give you that clarity. These are just a few of the analytics charts that are available out of the box with Apigee Edge. And you also have the ability to create custom reports that show data you care about, which clients are trending up, which device types show the most errors, how does traffic volume vary over the course of a day or a week? How effective is the cache? Which versions of my API are in low use that I might deprecate them? Using Apigee Edge Analytics gets you visibility into your API program that you absolutely need in order to understand usage and manage your API efforts.